Hello, my name is Sam Walker. I am in the 9 o'clock Fundamentals of Physics class, and I will be doing balloon rocket. I'll be rocketing balloons. Okay, so, so what we're going to be doing <laughs> is taking this very manly balloon, blowing it up, tying it to this magical string system, and letting it go, which should shoot it across because as the air is pushed out of the balloon the air pushes back on the balloon. This is Newton's third law which states for every action there is an equal or opposite reaction which means that as the air as I explained earlier comes out of the balloon the air pushes back on the balloon creating thrust and moment, move, movement movement that's what yeah Three, two, one. <laughs> Alright, now for a recap of everything. Three, two, one. This is where I release the balloon, showing Newton's third law that every action has an equal or opposite reaction, and the balloon starts moving. At this point, the balloon is still moving, and it is still Newton's third law. Aha! Here we are making a video showcasing Newton's third law when I also happen to showcase Newton's first law. An object in motion tends to stay in motion unless acted on by an external force. In this case, the external forces are air resistance and, well, a chair. The chair will do a pretty good job of stopping a balloon. It's not that hard.